Welcome back everybody. Today we're going to decorate the dining hall and the kitchen. Uh, before we do that, here's a quick montage of me gathering all this stuff for this. So you can't wake this dude up, but you can do this. Get the bed. And go to sleep. So we're going to do this in a U-shape, sort of. Have carpet in the middle, table in the middle with some food on top. We're going to make the tables out of fur and the chairs out of walnut, I think. I think it's going to look very nice with some purple carpet and a purple throne. But yeah, I think it's gonna look nice. The main feature in this room is going to be the food. With the Farmer's Delight mod, there are placeable foods that you can put down. You can put a roast chicken down and you can take from that. If you pick up a bowl, you can take a plate of roast chicken, potatoes, carrots, whatever else there is. Potatoes. But uh, <laughs> yeah. No, it's gonna it's gonna be cool. I think nearly sure you can roast a hoglin as well and have like a roast hoglin sitting on a table. I kinda want that as a feature. And I was in creative mode and I placed a couple of them down and they look really cool. So we're gonna make all these things. We're gonna make them in our new kitchen that we're gonna do now in a few minutes. So let me let me quickly speed up this part. It's just tables and chairs. Fur, tables, walnut, chairs. Fur tables, walnut chairs. Yes, and we're gonna have some purple carpet and a throne. Let's get this done. Okay, so for in here, I want obviously the stoves for cooking hamburgers and Krabby Patties and a smoker, cause, just cause, and well, a furnace. I think that's enough for the kitchen. I might even put campfires underneath them to look like they're smoking. And we got some redwood cabinets, cupboards. What is my cat doing? Oh, my cat's doing crazy things. Oh, we can't really have them in the corner, can we? No, we can't. Um, how can we do this? Yeah. Yep, yep. Is that too many? All in one row? Um, let me see. Put a counter in there. That doesn't actually have a door. It's just a counter top. No, I'm back. Oh my goodness. I love the red word. Look at the color. Red wood. Red word? <laughs> red wood. 
don't really know what to do here, to be honest. Let's definitely put some campfires underneath these, though. We want that smoky effect. We remove these. And the block. Can we remove the blocks underneath? Yes! I did double up on a couple of the ceilings. Just cause. Don't ask me why. I just did. It's a perfect for this, though. Stove, stove, stove. Smoker. And the... Where's my furnace? Furnace. Furnace. Boom. Now, it's not fucking awesome. I'm gonna need some sort of an extractor fan over there. Um, can you do a four-sided extractor fan without looking stupid? Oh, look at the smoke on the fucking ceiling. Or not the smoke, the ash. What do I want to do? Is that too many? All in one row, like? Mm. I'll just take these a couple of these out. Can I have it? What do I want? I can put two there. Let move these. Put it over the other side. I'm just gonna have the stoves here and then the vanilla stuff on the other side, like segregation. Because that worked. Sarcasm. Um, she sugars, I don't know what to do. Put that in there. More counter space. Look at this! I'm not happy. Oh, maybe these campfires weren't a good idea. Okay, I think I have it figured out. I'm gonna put the furnaces and the smoker here. Surround it with cupboards, counter cupboard things. These thingies. Up on the top and the bottom. It's gonna have like a separate kitchen area over here. Oh, I have these racks. These racks are from the... What do you call it? Connolly's. Connell That's not it. Co colonies. Colonies! Christ, why are words so difficult? <laughs> From the colonies mod. Um, which I'm gonna get into. I think it's it's kinda cool. It looks kinda cool anyway. I'm gonna try to get into it in this world. My plan for this world is obviously decorate this castle, but I don't know why. Really don't like that. I do not like this. Um, anyway, yeah. Decorate the castle. Don't know with what yet. We're going to discover that along the way, along our journey. And build like a city out from the castle, heading outwards. On the island. And mine colonies. Colonies. Connolly's? Con no, Connolly. No. Colonies. Colonies. Mine colonies. <laughs> Would be great. Um save a lot of building on my part but I still want to put my own buildings in I've learned a lot over the last little while I'm not a noob anymore so let me figure out this kitchen oh my god this is annoying me I don't like any of this look at it it's awful let me see if I can figure this out
think we're pretty much done with the kitchen. I want to stick a couple of sinks in, put something here. Put a couple of shelves up there. Not sure. I don't like that there. Take that down. It's my axe. Axe. There you are. You got what to do. And then put that there, maybe. Put a plant beside it. Yeah. A couple of shelves. Yeah. I like it. I like how this is after turning out. And the crates there, the shelves. I like it. I'm definitely going to change the floor because it's double layered so I can get away with it, it won't show underneath. Even if it did, I could always just fix it with slabs or something on the ceiling, but no, I don't think we need it. I'm going to put white ebony and white mangrove. Those two actually pop together. They're absolutely fabulous. And I'm going to put them down like tiles. Um, let me see. Nope. Nope. I want another sink. What's this? Let me see. What's this do? Can I put it down somewhere? No. Fair enough. I tried. Let me grab these planks and we'll do the floor in the kitchen. Ebony and white mangrove. Here, I think. Yeah. Here across. Should I do the steps? No, leave them. We're gonna do them in a sort of checker pattern. Like that. No. And look at how the two colors make they just complement each other so well black and white look at it fabulous absolutely fabulous it's perfect for a kitchen you can even make a nice building out of this uh oh you could you could have it all white and then you could have black roof um Maybe a deep slate loop would be better. Who knows? We'll see. We'll see what we can conjure up in the future.
definitely think a couple of shelves here would be nice. I'll move that melon. I can put something there. Until the melon is moved. Um, yeah, a couple of shelves here. You put the melon on top of the shelf. Um, barrel. Drinking, of course. Wine or beer or whatever it is you, you want to drink. It's in that barrel. Use your imagination. I don't think I like it sitting like that. Maybe this way. The other side. Yeah. Yeah, that's better. Yeah, that looks better. Alright. Let me see. I'm quite liking this. It's like a busy... Like a busy shop. Let's stick some stuff on the shelf. No. On the shelf. Up there. Yeah. What the hell? What is this? Ah. Shelf. Back up. Lantern? Yes! Okay, cool. Oh, I should place it weird. Where's my melon gun? Melon? Melon. Melon. Yeah. Perfect. Hang on. It's not sitting the way I want it. Ah, crap. It's not even sitting on the shelf there. Hang on. Oh, it's so tiny! <laughs> okay. Round three or four, whatever it is now. Seven? Melon. Now, oh, lovely. Lovely. Let me see. Walking in and at the melon. Melons everywhere. Do I want it like that? Let me see. One more time. One more time. One more time. Let me, let, let me walk away and kind of pull up. I'm gonna turn around. Wait. Yeah, that looks nice there. Yeah, definitely like that. Okay. I'm not mad on those mine colony shelves. Shelves. <laughs> Colin. Mine colony shelves. Jesus. Words are my friend. No, I don't like them there. Take them down. Um, I might do a couple of bits off camera, but for now, um, I think I'm going to call it a night. Thanks for joining in, you guys. Bye!